In this video, I'm going to explain the basic things that you will need to do to create your book trailer in Microsoft Movie Maker. The first thing you'll want to do is locate the program under the Start menu, click All Programs, and then find Movie Maker and open it. To begin working with Movie Maker, you'll want to add your videos or photos. We've saved photos from Britannica ImageQuest, so click on Add Videos and Photos. Find your folder under the Videos drive, click JES, double click Book Trailers, click your teacher's name, and then find the folder that is the name of your book. Click your first picture to insert it, and at this point your picture will appear in your working area. Now we're going to add narration for this by clicking on the picture, choosing Record Narration, and you'll press the Record button to record your sentence. I'm going to demonstrate that for you now. The first book in a new series by Patrick Carman introduces readers to Leo Fillmore, the clever son of janitor Clarence Fillmore. When you have finished, press Stop, and then you're going to save your narration in your folder make sure that you click on the videos drive, find the book trailer folder, your teacher's name, and your book name, and then press save. At this point, your narration will appear in an orange bar underneath the picture. Play this to check your narration. The first book in the new series by Patrick Carman introduces readers to Leo Fillmore You'll notice that it didn't say my entire sentence. To correct this, I'm going to click on Edit, and then where it says Duration, I'll add seconds until my entire sentence is read. Press Play to check it. Let's play it again from the beginning to make sure the entire sentence is in. The first book in the new series by Patrick Carman introduces readers to Leo Fillmore, the clever son of Janitor Clarence Fillmore. This was enough time for this particular sentence. I'll just go through these same steps for each of my pictures. So I'll click Home, Add Videos and Photos, I'll add my second picture, Record Narration, Leo and Clarence live in the basement of the Fickle Whippet Hotel and are stretched to the limit as they attempt to hold things together in the lengthy absence of Merganza Whippet, the owner and creator of the hotel. Save my work again. Press play. Leo and Clarence live in the basement of the Fickle Whippet Hotel and are stretched to the limit as they attempt to hold things together in the lengthy absence of Merganza I'll adjust my narration by clicking edit and increasing the time that wasn't enough so I need to add more time and I'll continue doing this until I've edited all of my pictures and all of my narration when I'm ready to publish my video trailer I'm going to first delete any text boxes that I didn't add. If you'll notice on this picture, there's a text box that says the Plaza Hotel. To delete that, I'm going to click in the pink box, right click, and choose Remove. That'll remove that text box. The next thing I want to do is I want to add a text box to the first slide that has the title and author of the book. I'll click Home. I'll choose the first slide. Click Caption, and then type in the author and title of the book. I'll resize this text box and move it so that it can be seen easily. The last thing I want to add to my book trailer are credits. To do that, I click Home. 
credits, and this automatically adds a slide at the end of the trailer where I can add again the title and author. and Britannica Image Quest, which is where I got my photos. When I finished, I'm going to play it again from the very beginning by clicking in the first picture box and pressing play. This will play the entire book trailer together so that I can check my timing. If I'm ready to save my movie, I go to the icon in the top, I choose save movie and I'll pick recommended for this project. Again you'll want to save this in your folder for your book trailer and then press save. And that's how you make a video using Microsoft Movie Maker.